my viewers. Special thanks to my subs. 4.5k, let's go 5k. Here we Today come. I'm breaking down an interview of Big U and Joe Rockhead. When's the last time you seen Rockhead? Shit. About, about a month ago. About a month ago. You're talking about I can and developing options. Yeah. Man. Let me right. tell you, these niggas, when this nigga came to 4800, the, all them niggas who was running 4800, all changed. Right. When this nigga, and I didn't know who he was. Like I said, I didn't know, I didn't know, like, who he meant to the crib car. I'm a young nigga, I'm only 18. Hey, honey, you was holding somebody's head like this, and you was pounding on him. <laughs> yeah, that, on was, him. No, that was three days later, no, though. but look, you was pounding on him. I mean, dude couldn't even fight back, didn't want to fight back, he just gave in. And I said, what you doing, dude? What the fuck you doing? I mean, it's like doing having sex with a girl. Was you coming fight. back from, uh, with, uh, uh, you was coming back from with, uh, who was saying? Yeah. Timeline yeah, but you already had been there. No bid. You already had made them work out. Then they moved you to the other side. Well, you had all these coming through praise. you. talking about when I like met you, though. That's what that was the about. That was the day. That oh. was in there. Okay. When they all came, and then when he got in there, he seemed too old to remember. He made all them niggas start working out. <laughs> he too old to remember. Yeah. He made all them niggas start working out. He had them niggas in the back doing cadence. Because it was the first time I heard a nigga say machine in motion. I hadn't even heard that before. I haven't, I never heard that till I heard you, till you had them doing it in the day. I was like, Jones, you down there? I was like, Jones, you down there? I'm saying, nah, but I'm watching these niggas, you know what I'm saying? And you had them niggas working out. You was talking about cleaning up. You was like, and you was telling them about how when you get to the pen, you don't have to be clean. You don't have to do this. You can't be spitting in the sink. He was the first person I heard say all that shit. Why he was the first person I heard say all that surprised? shit. Rockhead, no. what made you feel like you was in charge? Man, I'm Joe nigga. And there was plenty of soldiers up in there. was plenty of gladiators. But, was plenty but people what was the Lions then? 4,800. No, not to me. No, he ain't lying. Hey, so not look, to me. So look, he ain't exaggerating. Them no, niggas bowed see, down no, like... No, 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 not, not like that. I see, think about it. Like he, he, <laughs> he keeps saying they bowed down They to did. I, I'm, I'm telling you. But, I don't, he want to be modest. I, I swear to God, on my, on my, on my life. On my life. I like this big nigga, When this nigga walked in, that I mean I had already been there. I've but, been there for like about a week. You already had made them work. And what they the couldn't move question. us in no cell. What happened what happened in the holding tank when you had like fourteen people from eight not eight different neighborhoods and they all wanted to beat you up? So Rockhead was there a few days. Big U was there for a week already. How come they are in the holding tank together? Am I missing something? See, that was every time I went to nah, the... but, but they, they we was all shocked down. When I walked in, they was all talking about getting you said I fight two or three at a time. Yeah, that was uh, And you that, didn't believe him. That was that was every time I went to to, I, to court. I, 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 <laughs> hey, and so when he put his demo down, what was you thinking then? I was impressed. I I was so fucking impressed. I actually liked this motherfucker. I didn't like a lot of people. Even though it was Crip on Crip violence, you you, you still liked it, huh? I no, I liked it him. I didn't like the Crip on Crip violence. I, I despise it even now today. But I liked how he represented himself. He didn't go at them. They came at him. Was it reminiscent of CCO? What you saw in CCO? And then you came to, to 4800? Did he remind you of that? It had nothing to do with CCO. At that time, no, 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 I dismantled no, CCO. Like I found who Rockhead was while he was there. Because then he had, they had, after we in, in the day room, they had moved Rockhead to the other side. And then I, that's why I seen him at court. Because I had so many cases, I was going to court every single day. I was going to court every single, I mean, I, I was at court so much, man, I fell asleep in the courthouse. That's how I ended up getting the, um, the best lawyer I ever met, man. His name was Roger, no, no, not Roger. His name was, um, damn, man, that's stupid. All I, I my cases. say Earl Brody, man. Hell no, nah, man, I, he died, my lawyer died. Like, I'm, I'm tripping, I can't remember his name, but he died. But I met him because I fell asleep in court on one of my cases, I had a hot one, and I fell asleep. And the judge was like, "Man, what the hell you doing? Falling asleep? You got a uh, woo -woo. I'm like, "Man, look, man, I be out here every single day. I'm here. I'm at court every single day for for one of these cases. If it ain't Inglewood Court for traffic, if it ain't Inglewood Court for traffic." Went back to jail. 86, 85, 87. Had a lot of terrible cases. Had a lot of terrible cases. If it ain't Inglewood Court for traffic, I'm here for all this. He made them consolidate all my cases under one lawyer, dude beat all my cases. I end up coming home just on probation. 
so he big you was on probation leading up to the robbery of the undercover cop unless those cases well, big you that serious got out and we kind of reconnect i'm like man where you been I heard you been out for a few years he said rock now i told myself i'm gonna walk away step back and deal with myself for these four to five years and once i get off the road and everything then i'm gonna make my moves and the moves he made I said, I said it before, I'm going to say it now, was ridiculously awesome for him to create development options, for him to get into the music stuff, for him to do the things that he's doing positive in a strong, powerful way. Let's turn up the heat. Hey, yeah. did you all see that? Run it back.